Welcome to CCK Live. Today we're discussing the top ways to obtain VA disability benefits. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to our channel for all the latest VA disability information. The first way to pursue VA disability benefits is by establishing service connection for your disability. This could be by an initial claim or by a supplemental claim. An initial claim is the first time you file a claim in pursuit of VA disability benefits for particular injury or condition caused or aggravated by your military service. Veterans can file a claim at any time after military service using VA Form 21526EZ. It's important to include as much relevant evidence as possible when submitting your initial claim to improve your chances at a favorable decision the first time. Veterans who are not quite ready to file a VA claim but plan to do so within one year can submit an ITF or intent to file with a VA Form 21-0966. The date you submit your intent to file will become your effective date if your claim is submitted timely. Veterans still in service can obtain VA disability benefits by filing a claim up to 180 days before leaving the service. If you have 90 to 180 days left on active duty, you may be eligible to file a pre-discharge claim through the Benefits Delivery at Discharge program. This can help speed up the claims decision process. If you are a veteran who has less than 90 days left on active duty, or soon to be veteran, you won't be eligible for the BDD program. However, you can still file before you're discharged and your claim will be processed after separation as a fully developed or standard claim. Your effective date will be the day after your formal discharge. Similarly, filing any time within one year of discharge will preserve an effective date of the day after discharge. And another way to obtain VA benefits is by filing a supplemental claim. A VA supplemental claim is a claim for disability benefits filed by a claimant who had previously filed for the same or similar benefits on the same or similar basis. VA is required to re-adjudicate the claim if new and relevant evidence is presented. To file a supplemental claim, veterans should use VA Form 20-0995. It's important to note that veterans need to have new and relevant evidence that VA hasn't seen before in order to file this type of claim. New and relevant evidence can be new supporting documents like doctor's reports and medical test results. Moving on, the next pathway to VA disability benefits is filing a claim for an increased rating. This is when a veteran files a claim for more compensation for disability that VA has already determined to be service-connected. Veterans can file for an increased disability compensation if you have a rated service-connected disability that has gotten worse. To be successful, you will need to submit medical evidence showing your condition worsened, as well as an updated VA Form 21-526-EZ. With an increased rating claim, veterans may also obtain special benefits by raising the issue. For example, a veteran may file a claim for an increased rating to be eligible for benefits like TDIU and special monthly compensation. To raise TDIU, veterans should submit VA Form 218940. For more information on these benefits, you can check out some of our other videos. To learn more about the different pathways to VA disability compensation and using evidence to support your claim, be sure to check out our blog at cck-law.com blog. And thank you for tuning in. 